Okay, so we are jumping back into more GTA 3 Definitive Edition. So far, all is good, minus a couple of funny moments. <laughs> Let's put it that way. Right now, my feet are sinking into the floor. That's that's nice. So, what's our next mission going to be? We have this one over here, and that's it. Yeah, that's it. Just the one. Alright, so I guess we'll head over there. No? Can I get a... Can I get a GPS location? Doesn't want to give me one. I am pressing X on it, and it does not want to give me one. So, that's a little, uh... A little strange. Sometimes it gives you... Hey, hey, hey. I want the car. I guess I'll just take the taxi. But, hey! Stop the, stop the taxi. Stop that taxi. Stop it. Ugh. Oh, yeah, there's another one. I swear to God, if you... Oh, my... Oh, I ain't taking the cop car. These pedestrians do not want me to steal their cars. Get this one. Thank you. Well, they're giving me a GPS thing on the map, so that's good. But sometimes they do, and sometimes they don't. Like, if I wanted to place one on my own, they wouldn't really tell me where to go. It's odd. Don't know if that's by design, or something that needs to be patched. I cranked up the volume a little bit on the radio since the last video because I really wasn't hearing too much of it. I think I made it a little bit too low. Again, hoping that these videos won't get claimed because I don't want to turn off the radio completely and just have nothing but silence while driving. Ooh, I am so sorry. Out of my way. Alright, I better be able to start this mission. Better not give me some kind of time BS. There we go, good. Chunky Lee Chung is pushing spank for some new gang from Columbia or Colorado or something. I'm not really sure. Who needs details? Anyway, he's got a noodle stand down in Chinatown. Who that needs rat details? sold his last stir fry. I want you to take him out. If you need a piece, go around back of ammunition opposite the when you subway. you say take him out, you mean... With a nine. You know where it is, right? Well, remember, just lunch? watch it back in Chinatown. It's triad territory. Take him out to lunch. Take him out to see a movie. Or take him out to meet his maker. You gotta be more specific. Give me this. He said if I need a piece, there's one around the back of ammunition, but I don't think I need a piece, do I? No. Where is this guy? Over here. And on the map there is actually no GPS uh, telling me how to get there. So that waypoint is completely pointless. Baseball bat right there. Two of them actually. Well, that's that's the guy, obviously. Well then. <laughs> right. Worst security ever. <laughs> Security is pointless. No. What are you doing? Here we go. Just, I don't need the waypoint off the map. I don't need that. 
So you see down that right there, they actually gave me directions with that waypoint, but they didn't before. They gave me directions after I was done with the mission. So there clearly must be a bug. There's no denying it after that. That mission was way too easy. Oh, crap, my broken up car is still here. Van Heist. Alright, we're gonna hit the payroll van. It leaves the edge of Chinatown every day. Bullets won't even dent the van's armor, so get a car and ram it off the road. Oh, now great. hit it hard, and the punk-ass security guard should bail. And take it to the warehouse at the docks, and my guys are gonna take over from there. Now, it won't be doing its rounds all day, so don't hang around. Alrighty. That seems simple enough. No shooting, just ramming. Hmm. You know what, the shooting. didn't. No, 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 hit the... Oh, crap. Alright, there's one over here. If we're gonna ram them, we're gonna need a bigger truck, so... This should do. Traffic sucks. Alright, here it comes. Damn it. Damn it. I thought you said the punk security guards would leave. Why aren't they leaving? Ram. Ram. Come on. Ah. And again. One more. Hey, where are you going? Wasn't done ramming you yet. Drive to the wall or something, would you? Almost there. Oh god, now here come the cops. You know, officer. I'm just ramming you here. Okay, they ran off. Nice. No, no, no. You are risking your life. How did he pull me out of a vehicle that I was pulling away from? I was driving away. Well, thank God we got checkpoints. I have to restart the whole entire mission from the beginning, driving all the way here. But it is what it is. How do I get busted as I was driving away? Oh, crash! Ooh, an ice cream truck. What? Where did he come from? Where did the cop come from? I... I have no words for that. Alright, let's see how this works with a smaller car. Are all these cars just driving away from me today, for some reason? All the cars I want to rob. It's like they learned from the last video. If you see him coming right away from him. The AI is getting smarter. Third time's a charm. Big hit, little damage. No 
damage at all. Yeah, so using this... Using this car. He's just pushing this car like nothing. This is easy for him. Get out the damn car. Come on. funny how they leave after you only take a certain amount of damage. All of this doesn't scare the guards at all. He's just pushing me. What? Well, it's causing damage. This is working. Oh god, here comes the cop. Yeah, run him over. Super cops. I can run at super speed and throw you out of a car while you're driving away. Oh no, I flipped. Get out of the car. Run. 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 Crap. 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 Get here. Get. No. No. Give me this. Give me this. Ah. Oh, this is not good. This is definitely not good. I could use a car right now. Not the cop car. Please don't shoot me. And they're shooting me. No. Ah. This is not going well at all. Can I have this? Give me this. I swear to God, the soft wolf to pull me out of this car. I swear to God. Well, that's a fire truck. I could have used that one. That would've been good. Guess who's back? He's current. Oh my god, he's stuck. This is perfect. If these super cops would leave. Oh my god, these stupid cops. I am doing nothing wrong. I am just ramming one vehicle. Absolutely nothing else wrong. Another flip. Ah. Oh. So close. I was so close. How did I have one mission that I was able to complete in two seconds? But yet this mission is going to be a pain in the ass. I was seriously able to do the last mission in two seconds. Walked up to him, shot him right in the head. Easy peasy. But ramming a truck. Or a van or whatever. This is what's going to give me a hard time. All the other missions thus far were a complete breeze. But something as simple as ramming a van. I give my fourth attempt to why are you sliding away for? Her? The van has really bad handling. I got a one star one level as soon as I just lightly tap the van. Cops. LCPD. The extremely aggressive LCPD. Oh, you're turning? Couldn't just follow the straight road, huh? That would be too much to ask. 
I don't care how old you are. Get out of the van. If you're actually 62 years old, you shouldn't be putting up this much of a fight. Doesn't your life mean something to you? I'm pretty sure you have a family. Wife, kids, grandkids. Is it worth it for a van? Alright, one more hit should do it. Then the problem is just these stupid cops. Alright, he's left. He left the van. Hurry. Move your ass. Drive. Drive. No. No. Cop is trying to run alongside my vehicle. Absolutely not. Oh, I got squished. Okay, listen, it was fun when I was ramming into this thing, but it's not so fun when they ram into me, so please stop it. Oh, thank God. Get in here. Oh, thank the Lord. It's over. Oh, that took way longer than it should have. That took way longer than it should have. Oh, hello, beeper. Elboro wants to offer you an opportunity. Get to the payphone. Payphone, Jesus Christ. In Helburn Heights. If you want more info. There's a place you can go. Rush, rush, do the A.O. my god. I remember when payphones were a thing back in my day. I used a couple of payphones back in my time. Back in my younger years. Very small. This is El Boro at the Diablo. You are new in Liberty, but already you are gaining a reputation on the streets. There is a street race starting by the old school hall near the Callahan Bridge. Get yourself some wheels and first through all the checkpoints wins the prize. Okay. Got races now. Get yourself some wheels. Huh. No, I don't think this car is going to cut it. Is there any faster cars nearby? No, oh, taxi's not going to work. Now this is what I call a car. There we go. That's more like it. Fix it up a little bit. Alright, let's try to get there nice and slow like. Nice and peaceful to get there without banging up the car too much. So good. Not too much traffic. I see the starting line. Right ahead of me. There it is. Go. Oh, you idiots. Wait. Confused by the map. Go this way? Yeah, they're all going this way. I need to 
third, I think. Yeah, third. Oh, he crashed. Oh, I crashed. Oh. Yeah, this is... Not good. This vehicle is fast, but it handles like shit. Sliding all over the place. I missed a turn. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Fourth place. And way behind. Oh, no, wait. Hold on. He crashed too. I don't see anybody else. Which is not good. I don't see first or second. Oh, there they are. There's one. Terrible crash. smoking. No, I'm good. I'm good. That wasn't me. False alarm. I right, get to oncoming traffic. I see a second place one. Kind of crash, so I get the opportunity to pass him. Oh, you bitch. This is very slippery and slidey all over the place. Okay. Second. Somebody over completely destroyed them. Oh, great. That was a cop car. That's just great. Mission failed. Not good. Alright, so that vehicle completely sucked. car absolutely sucked, but it was fast. <laughs> it wasn't for the couple of wrong turns and crashes, I probably could have won that race. Second time's a charm. They all crashed into each other, I just think. Oh my god. Oh, come on. All kind of swerved into each other in the beginning, right there. That was too good to be true. There is no way this is going to be so smooth. No way. That was way too good to be true. Watch out for the truck. Watch out. Stop sliding. This car is very slidey. No, you missed a turn, you idiot. Oh, you bitch. Oh, you bitch is. Stop 
crash into me. Ah. This car even didn't slide all over the place. I would have run one this race five minutes ago. But I am fighting the car. Along with all these other racers. Why did I... Why was I sliding? Why is this a slip and slide? Oh my god, he just crashed. What? I did not miss the checkpoint. I was right there. The race is over. The race is over. It's over. Uh, it was too far from the checkpoint, according to them. Race is now officially dead. And I had a chance. But now this race is over. Mission failed. So close. Shut up. Give me this, give me this, give me this, give me this, give me this. Damn it. Ooh, red light. Move your ass. No, green light. No, 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 no. <laughs> Try this car. Maybe this car won't slide all over the place. Jump right into my car. Let's see if this car won't slide all over the place. What is this, GTA Online? It's like a GTA Online race where they all crash into you as soon as the race gets started. This is one of the reasons why I don't play GTA Online. He crashed. Why must we drive to oncoming traffic? Why must that be a part of the race? Stupid truck. Just gotta try to stay nice and calm. Calm and cool. Everything. Oh, of course, of course. Here you are. Yeah, go ahead. Crash and burn. Whoa. Okay. 
way. So far, so good. Thank you for that bump. That actually helped me. Why is my car sliding? I jumped us. Okay, that worked. And I'm still in first, driving on the wrong side of the road again. Well, so much for first. Stop crashing into me. You dicks. I pray to God that there aren't that many races in this game. Like I said before, I really didn't play too much in GTA 3. So I don't know how many races there are, but this is... This is hell right now. This is GTA Online levels of hell. And on top of that, the cars are deciding to slide all over the place. But so far, this car hasn't been too bad. Not like the last car. That last car was like a bar of soap in a prison shower. This the end of the race? Oh, thank God. Oh, thank God. I never want to do that again. I never want to do that race ever again. What do you want? Chaparani's oh, chauffeur. This is the guy I was telling you about. I right, listen, this guy he ain't Italian and he's no mechanic, but he could get things fixed. This is Pop's Capo, Tony Cipriani. Yeah, I'm Tony Cipriani. Cipriani. Take him to Mama's restaurant at St. Mark's. All right. Now listen to me. I'm planning a job that needs a good driver, so drop by sometime later, okay? And <laughs> you want to actually hire me? You just said a good driver. Did you not watch those uh, last four races I just did? Paying their protection money. And watch the car. Joey just fixed this junkie. So no fancy crap, okay? Oh, this way. Of course, there's a big line of traffic here where I can't turn easily. Of course. I don't know what these cars are doing, but there we go, that works. I'll try to get him there in one piece. After all that sliding around. There's my car. Still there. After all that slip and slide stuff, I want to try to keep this as nice and calm as possible. Good. Wait here. Keep the engine running. This ain't a social call. Uh oh. I don't sound good. Why do you have a bat? You just gotta get your laundry. Who needs a bat to go pick up some clothes? And don't bring a bat to a gunfight either. Weird ass laundromat. Guess they must have shrunk his clothes. Now with all that shooting, they're gonna turn all his clothes from white to pink. The triads think they can mess with me. The triads think they broke me. Drop 
Well, the tribe did shoot you, buddy. They did shoot you in the back several times. And for a guy that got shot in the back several times, you, uh, looking pretty good. A little stiff walking out the car, but other than that, not too bad. Got any stories on unlocked? Wait, what? What was that? Stock of ammunition. Sure. Whatever. Thank you very much. Something's that ammunition. That's all I know. That's all I know is that there's something that ammunition. Here's another message. Any more sec What? Bring them to our garage in Portland Harbor. Any more something that I want? I don't know. I couldn't really read that. I was trying to drive. Somebody's shooting? Who's shooting? This is a bad neighborhood. You want a license too? Do I need a license? I'll take that. I got two guns. Pistol and a micro. Alright, what's next? Either that over there, or this all the way down there. Might as well go here. It's right there. Might as well go to the closest mission. It's in there. Taking out the laundry. Take a goddamn seat. So the laundry won't pay any protection, huh? The triads think they can mess with me? Let's teach these would-be tough guys what it means to be a tough guy. Sounds like fun. Sorry, Ma. Yes, Ma. I want you to destroy their laundry vans and mangle any triad gimp that gets in your way. Eight ball can supply you with what you're gonna need. Oh boy. Oh boy. Can you not jump? Okay, there we go. So Three of them on the map. Can I cut through here? Can I drive through this? I can. Okay. Sometimes those bushes were rock solid in the older games, so I wasn't too sure. My car's just still there from the racing. It's interesting. Whoa. Oh, there goes the back. Right into a cop car. And the cop does not care. Is there an easy way to do this other than ramming them? Feels if I'm missing something. Oh god, get out of there. He didn't want to get out of there. Take a gun. He said eight ball could supply me what I need, but they didn't really give me a waypoint to eight ball. 
Where's my car? Alright, uh... Let's see, where is 8-Ball? There is no 8-Ball on the map over here, I have no idea where it is. He said they could supply me with what I need, but... So the 8-Ball can supply you with what you're gonna need. But what does that actually mean? Why they can supply me with what I need, because they're not on my map. I completely forgot where they were the last time we were there. They're not really on my map. Which is not very helpful. That's just gangs. Should I be ramming these, uh, trucks? Should I be stealing these trucks? What exactly am I supposed to be doing with these trucks? Destroying them, stealing them, and taking them to eight ball? You gotta be more specific. Why are these cars so slidey all of a sudden? weird because I was actually complimenting how well the cars were in the last video, that was last night, but now they seem to be sliding all over the place. By the amount of damage this has taken, oh I'm gonna flip it. I did nothing. So... Still not really telling me exactly what to do here. <laughs> Should I be destroying these things or not? There's another one. Where's one I was chasing? Up there. Okay. Let's see what happens. Alright, that's one destroyed. Let's see if I just destroy them. Son of a bitch. See, kid. Take a goddamn seat. So the laundry won't pay any protection, huh? The triads think they can mess with me? Let's teach these would-be tough guys what it means to be a tough guy. See, by that language, it leads me to believe I should be destroying these trucks. Yes, ma. I want you to destroy their laundry vans and mangle any triad gimp that gets in your way. Well, that's, uh... <laughs> How did I miss that line of dialogue <laughs> the first time? So he does want me to destroy them. I completely missed that line of dialogue the first time. Destroy these. It's just so weird that he was like, oh, eight ball need has what you need, but yet they don't tell me to go to eight ball. One down. The car's banged up, so I'm just gonna get a new one. 
It's gonna blow up any second. Crash. Go around them. Don't wanna cause any unnecessary damage to my car. Because all of a sudden, these controls got very slippery. Even though they weren't slippery last night when I first played this game. And now for some reason the cars are sliding all over the place. Very odd right now, what's happening. Very odd. fire. There we go. They just jumped right in front of my car. That's nice. Alrighty then. Hello. No, no, get back over here. There we go, he's on fire. Mission passed. Very nice. Dead skunk in the trunk, ew. Beautiful, just beautiful. All right, just the guy I need to talk to. All right, there's a car stuffed with a stiff at the cafe near Callahan Point. One of the Ferrellis thought he was a wise guy, so he got what he had coming to him. Take the corpse to the crusher in Harwood, all right? Seems simple enough. But then again, that's why I said about the other mission, and uh, took me four tries. <laughs> some particular reason, I know I didn't adjust the sensitivity to the driving. That much I know. Aim things over there. First person sensitivity. I, there is nothing you can do to adjust the sensitivity to the driving, but for some reason these cars just seem to be a little bit more slippery. And I remember how they were last night. Like, literally 10, 12 hours ago. It's almost like this game feels like GTA 4. Which makes sense, because it does take place in the big city. But those cars in GTA 4, whew. GTA 4 is a good game, but my god, those cars. Uh, driving. Oh boy. Oh god. Speak to the crusher. Well, they're chasing me. This is this is nice. This is nice. Very nice. Yeah. Yep. Uh-huh. Yep. Excellent. <laughs> Excellent. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Alright, just the guy I need to talk to. Alright, there's a car stuffed with a stiff at the cafe near Callahan Point. One of the Ferrellis thought he was a wise guy, so he got what he had coming to him. Take the corpse to the crusher in Harwood, alright? <sighs> that was just excellent. As soon as I got in there, they immediately flipped me over.
Why are these cars so slippery now? <laughs> it is really driving me insane here. Because I was literally just praising the game last night for not having slippery cars. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Who cares about them? Die. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this. No, seriously, look at this. Because I can't look. Awful. Beautiful. Awful. No, not beautiful. Awful. <laughs> not beautiful, just beautiful. Terrible. Awful. Really awful <laughs> that mission was. <laughs> Let's try again. 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 Yeah, yeah, it's the brothers. We know, we know. And they immediately crash into me, swerve into me, and all of the above. And that one flipped. That one ran me over. Add the vehicle, you punk. Just running around in circles like a dumbass. Hey, come on, get out of the car. Face me like a man, let's go. How is he not flipping all over the place? Thank you. Blow up and die. Thank you. Stay dead. I will be pissing on your grave soon. Once I deliver this to the crusher, I will return to piss on your grave. Jesus Christ. That was annoying. Alright, now maybe we could actually drive there in peace without having the car flip over every two seconds. There we go. This is good. Sometimes you just gotta take matters into your own hands. Sometimes you can't just run away, or in this case, drive away from a fight. Sometimes you have to get out of your car and just shoot them. That's exactly what I did. Drive into me. That, that's excellent. I like it when trucks drive into me. Or at least attempt to drive into me. You know, the only wild driver in this game is supposed to be me. I'm supposed to be the only one that's causing havoc in the streets. Not the AI cars. Me. <laughs> I'm the one with the controller in my hand. Alright, here we go. We're at the crusher. Don't flip over. What is this car doing? Turn into a low rider all of a sudden. Okay, crush it.
we really have to watch this whole thing? Okay, that was nice. 10 Gs. Part of the area maybe be crushed. So I guess you could just maybe do this uh, whenever you want, is what I'm assuming. Kind of like a uh, Mafia 2. You can just park any car there and get it crushed and get some cash for it. Is that what that means? Or are they talking just about this mission only? Now I'm curious. Hmm. Well, I'll be damned. You can actually park any car there and it gets crushed. How much money am I going to get? Do I get any money at all? I got it. Looks like a couple hundred bucks, it looked like. So, that's where Mafia 2 got the idea from Grand Theft Auto 3. I never knew that. Now I know. It's good to learn new things. But anyway, that's gonna pretty much do it for this video. For the most part, <laughs> these two dudes got run over. But anyway, for the most part, I am enjoying the classic Grand Theft Auto 3. Even though some of these missions can be a pain in the ass, and the handling of the cars is, Ooh. but until next time, be sure to like this video, comment, subscribe, turn notifications, all that good stuff. And I am Elt signing out.